Developing now in Cleveland, a car barrels right through a building. One man is hospitalized and Ohio City businesses, including a popular restaurant, are picking up the pieces. 19's Vic Gideon explains what's next for the neighborhood after this quite a scary morning. A gaping hole in a building across the street from the West Side Market. People with the building surveying the aftermath saying it will be a while before the popular Argentinian-style steakhouse, Jaja, will reopen. A blow to the neighborhood. And this, is a, this, this is bad. This is really horrible. And I hate to see this happen in this neighborhood now, okay? That we are really coming up and from where it used to be. It is amazing now. And it's, this is sad that this happened. Jaja opened two years ago in a building with new apartments. Neighbors there waking up to a loud bang and then chaos. I heard a huge crash uh, and, you know, we heard someone scream call 911, so we ran downstairs and there was a big group of people pulling a man out of this uh, wreckage. The 24-year-old man transported to Metro Health Medical Center with serious injuries. Police saying speed appears to be a factor, but confirming the black Audi with Georgia plates had not been stolen. Car into a building with possible entrapment. The car appears to have been speeding down Abbey, hit a fire hydrant, which was here, and now sits over there, hit a barrier, jumped an almost 12 inch curb, and then crashed into the building. It's amazing. He had to be really flying. He had to really be going fast. What won't be fast? The reopening. There's no timeline, but owners say it won't happen anytime soon. Police say the crash investigation is ongoing. Vic Gideon, 19 News.